another wonderful afternoon in the city of Lagos, Nigeria, Africa. And on that note, I welcome you to Unbelievable Moments with Ibrazano Adams. It's a magazine program that encompasses music, sports, and what I feel. But there's a lot of development in the polity now, so we're really going to get straight into it. And for now, let's tell you that the executive chairman of Otupo Local Government Council, Right Honorable George Ali has condemned the recent attack on the executive governor of Benue State, His Excellency Dr. Samuel Oton. The chairman also described the attack on the governor as shocking, unfortunate and sad. He said, and by expressing a lot of doubt about how and why the hues and cries about the whole development, he said the attack on the government, governor is callous, distasteful and reprehensible. He said that the attack was done to frustrate and thwart his effort in ensuring the safety of his state. Honorable Judge Ali states that the attack is regrettable and urges the governor not to allow this unfortunate act jeopardize his determination towards arresting all forms of criminality in the state. The chairman further urges security agencies to apprehend the perpetrators of this regrettable and unsympathetic act. And straight away to another development, let's tell you that the executive chairman of the local government council, right Honorable George Ali, is also mourning the death of ex-Super Eagle striker and manager of Lobby Stars FC, Barnabas Imienga. He said he received the news of his death with shock and sadness. Ali said, I was deeply saddened by the news of Barnabas' death this morning. That was talking about yesterday. The news is shocking and painful. His death is a big loss, not only to Benue State, to the whole country, because he served his country at the national level. He said, I visited him in the hospital with some officials of Lobby Stars last weekend, and he was in high spirit. He said, may God accept his soul and comfort his family, especially his aged mother. The Tukbo Local Government Council prayed. Imianga was a former Super Eagles striker in the mid-90s. He was part of the Super Eagles team that played at the 1995 FIFA Confederation Cup in Saudi Arabia. Imenga was, Imenga was appointed team manager of Lobby Stars in 2013. And from there, we'll move forward. And this time, let's tell you that the local government chairman in Benue State, South Senatoria, this reason, Su C, have been called upon to emulate the executive chairman of the local government council. Right, Honorable George Ali, in adopting security strategies that will lead to peace in their domain. The call was made by the Commissioner of Police, Benue State Police Command, CP Audu A. Madaki, during a town hall meeting he had with stakeholders comprising of chairmen from the Zoom, community chiefs, leaders of Igbo, Hausa, and Yoruba communities, members of Police Community Relations Committee, security agencies, Benue State Vigilante Service, and members of Homeland Defense. The CP who was on familiarization visit to police formation in the Zoom commended Honorable George Ali for his proficient handling of security matters. Madaki said, I am happy to hear from the chairman of the local government that he has done a lot of community policing. He has interceded on behalf of the police to settle so many crises involving farmers and elders within the community. That's a very good one, he said. He means he is not only playing the role of the chairman. He has proven that he is the chief security officer of the local government. I also want other local government chairmen operating within the area to emulate the honorable chairman of Otuko local government. The Tukbo local government chairman told the gathering that the collaborative efforts of Otuko local council with security agencies, traditional rulers, Benue State Vigilante Service, the Homeland Defense, as well as constant engagement with other stakeholders has led to drastic reduction in crime in Otuko local government, except for pockets of crisis between herders and farmers. Ali said, he gladdens my heart so to warmly welcome you to Otupo, the headquarters of Idoma Land. I thank you for all this important visit to Otupo, the heart of the lion. Your presence means a lot to us. Me and my team are fully committed to the maintenance of peace and security of all residents of Otupo. Rebali also assured the CP that he and his colleagues are collaborating to have neighborhood watch code name Know Your Neighbor. He said, with such efforts, visitors and newcomers to communities within the zone will be identified and properly monitored. CP Malaki also proposed the establishment of what he called local government representative consultation committee in each local government in the zone. 
He says such committee should comprise leaders of interest group in the local government and headed by the chairman of local government. Other local government chairmen who were present during the meeting are chairman of Bolhumini local government, Honorable Faith Agbo, chairman of APA local government, Honorable Ame Akoche, and chairman of Agatu, Honorable Sule Adoy. In another development, let's tell you that popular otupo based Akara Mechan Justice Onei pays George Ali a thank you visit in his office. It was American best selling author Melody Bitu who said, Gratitude makes sense of our past, brings peace for today, and creates a vision for tomorrow. This is what may have prompted the rave of the moment. Popular Otupo based a Karabinsk seller, Justice Onei, also known as Minister for Laughter, to pay a thank you visit to the executive chairman of Otupo local government, right Honorable George Ali in his council office in Otupo. Now he was accompanied by his manager and human rights activist, Mrs. Julie Oja Oko, also known as MC Kwakwakwa, met with the chairman who was seated with the Benue State PDP woman leader, Chief Mrs. Abeji Egwa, thank Honorable Ali for his encouragement, being among the first people to identify with his vision, even before other stations start running interviews about him. Honorable Ali also said uh, he was while receiving the duo that he is proud of Oney for taking the bull by the horn to chart a cross for himself in the face of unemployment opportunities. Ali urged other able-bodied unemployed youth in Otupo to drop their pride and emulate justice on Oney by picking up anything that will enable them to pay their bills, provided it is legitimate. God does not bless idle hand, Ali said. So many issues, so many things are going on, but the young man has proven to be whom you want to be by picking up something that nobody thought about. Another development, let's tell you that the executive chairman of Otupo Local Government Council, right Honorable George Ali, has called on the people of Otupo, including council staff and health workers, to come all out for the COVID-19 immunization vaccine to prevent the spread of coronavirus in Otupo Local Government whenever the vaccination exercise begins. The chairman made a call when he received the World Health Organization that is the LGAF, Mrs. Mercy Chair, accompanied by Mr. Sunday Atta, State Technical Facilitator, the Director of Health of Tupo Local Council, on Mrs. Margaret Odada and the Supervisory Councillor for Health, Honorable Enna Yusuf, during the advocacy visit to the Council Secretariat. Honorable Ali said, I want to use this medium to call on our people to turn up for the COVID-19 vaccine inoculation. The vaccine is meant to boost people's immunity against the dreaded coronavirus and it has not recorded any adverse reaction. Mrs. Chair on her part thanked the chairman for his warm reception accorded them. Mrs. Chia said there's a lot of rumors and conspiracy theories out there concerning the vaccines, but urged the people to discountenance such rumors as they have no specific backing. She also said since this vaccine arrived in Nigeria on the 4th of March 2021, many Nigerians, including Mr. President, have all been vaccinated, but none of them have any complaints. According to the World Health Organization, coronavirus has killed more than 2.6 million people and infected over 120 million others worldwide and we move forward let's tell you that the executive chairman of Otupo local government right on rebel george ali is a youth at heart to the core wherever two or three youths are gathered he's there to offer his support his presence is visible for all to see at every gathering of youth in benway state and beyond the boundaries of benway valley and also on sunday march 14 2021 at the palace of ochidoma agabaidu oche his royal highness chief dr elias ikoi obekwa where the oche oche Doma youth wing esco led by comrade obande gideon was being inaugurated honorable george ali and his adult local government council by honorable james oche alongside distinguished senator Abba Moro and Reverend Dave Ogbole led other Idoma sons and daughters to honor the executives. It's always like that and that's how he has been. He's been everywhere supporting good cause. And from there, let's tell you, take you to sports. And this is the last part of the reports that we have on him today. The Otupo local government chairman's vision is broad and so he has spread his tentacles in various fields of endeavor as enunciated with sports, human capacity development and ongoing projects. The ongoing chairman's cup is an avenue to fish out new talent who so will in turn take over from the aging ones and also create a platitude for varieties. 
A little pictography of the ongoing chairman's cup will give you an inkling to what we are talking about. We are here, we're profiling him because we know that he's contributing to youth emancipation, human capacity building, and also construction, and also giving people the dividends of democracy. That's the real reason why we, we, we're kind of profiling him on this program today. This is the much we can take on today's edition of Unbelievable Moments with Ibrozano Adams. You can place ads on this program. Call the number on your screen and also get in touch with us via our Instagram handle and Twitter handle and all what have you. To, to, to my directors and to everyone who has contributed greatly to the success of this program, as I bid you bye-bye, I say God bless you. I ring on top, I ring on top.